Having trouble charging your DJI Osmo Mobile 7P? Let's systematically troubleshoot the most common charging issues with proven solutions. First, inspect your USB-C cable for any visible damage. Look for bends, cuts, kinks, or exposed wires that could prevent proper charging. Next, verify that your power outlet or USB port is working properly by testing it with another device like your phone or tablet. Clean the USB-C port on your gimbal using compressed air or a soft brush to remove any debris or dust that might block the connection. Ensure the charging cable is firmly and completely inserted into the USB-C port. A loose connection is a common cause of charging failures. If your gimbal feels hot to the touch, unplug it and allow it to cool down for at least 30 minutes before attempting to charge again. Try different charging methods, such as a power bank, car charger, or different wall adapter to isolate whether the issue is with your original charger. Observe the battery level indicator on your gimbal. A blinking light indicates charging is in progress, while a solid green light means the device is fully charged. No response may indicate a hardware problem. Restart both the gimbal and the DJI MIMO app to resolve any software-related charging issues that might be preventing proper power management. For Bluetooth connection problems, reset the connection by simultaneously holding the shutter record button, switch button, and trigger for two seconds. If you're using the multifunctional module, ensure it's correctly aligned and securely connected to the gimbal handle for proper charging functionality. Remember that the power cable and audio recording cable included with your Osmo Mobile 7P are not interchangeable. The power cable lacks USB signal capability and cannot be used for audio recording. Use the correct cable for each function. When basic troubleshooting steps don't resolve your charging issues, it's time to explore advanced solutions and learn how to maximize your Osmo Mobile 7P's battery life. If all troubleshooting steps fail, contact DJI support for professional diagnosis and repair options, especially if your device is still under warranty. Now let's explore proven strategies to extend your Osmo Mobile 7P's battery life and get the most out of each charge. First, minimize fill light usage on the multifunctional module. The fill light is a major power drain, so only use it when absolutely necessary for your shots. Second, disable active track when you don't need it. While active track is a powerful feature, it consumes significant battery power during operation. Third, avoid using your gimbal as a power bank unless it's an emergency. Charging your phone through the gimbal significantly reduces its operating time. Fourth, ensure your phone is properly balanced on the gimbal. Poor balancing forces the motors to work harder, draining battery faster, and potentially causing overheating. Fifth, use standby mode when not actively shooting. Triple tap the M button to deactivate the motors and save significant battery power during breaks. It's important to understand that the multifunctional module significantly impacts battery life. While DJI advertises up to 10 hours of battery life, using the module with active track can reduce this to just three to four hours. Finally, be aware of cable compatibility issues. Some users find that the Osmo Mobile 7P doesn't charge with all USB-C cables. Using an older Motorola charger or the official DJI USB-C to lightning cable may resolve connectivity problems. By following these advanced solutions and battery optimization tips, you'll maximize your Osmo Mobile 7P's performance and enjoy longer, more productive shooting sessions.